non-playable Canadians. You know what month it is? Heroes 2, Hero Harder. You know who's my hero this month? Loot Crate. Because this is the earliest in the month I have gotten my loot crate in forever. So, props and thank you for the m sweet early loot crate. And look at the size of this beast. Bigger than my head. Bigger than my head. Bigger than my head. This is a large crate. I don't know what we're going to get in this, but I'm excited to find out. Okay. Uh-oh. Have I misplaced a very large knife again? Sure have. Not. <laughs> Cutting that open. Let's find out what we got this month. Full of heroic goodies, I'm sure. Ready? Here comes the reveal. You're finding out what I'm finding out. Oh, we got part of a building with people inside. Go Batman, they're saying. More of a building. Don't think there's any surprises there. Oh, don't everything fall out. Don't everything fall out. Oh my gosh, it looks like a sweet Batman thing. Oh man, I made the box upside down. Alright, whatever. Let's get in. Get in it. Look at this guy. Batman Classic TV Series. That's fun. I like it. Although, I think uh, Adam West was a bit chubbier in the bat suit, to be honest. But that is a fantastic little figure. I like it. I like it a lot. Okay. Oh. In memory of Mr. Nimoy. Live long and prosper. He lived pretty long. He prospered plenty. Let's say that. Oh. <laughs> it's a Batman multi-tool. Oh my gosh. It is... What does it include? A bottle opener, crosshead screwdriver, and flathead screwdriver. Oh my gosh. This is amazing. How can I not put this on my keychain? Well, I guess there's a large size I have to consider. It also doubles as something you can use to break open shitty cardboard packaging. Oh my gosh. On the downside, I accidentally bent the crap out of the key ring that connects it already. And uh, so now it's going to have to attach some other way. But this is awesome. The screwdriver parts are mia and mia. That is so good. Alright, I will attach that to all the things and be happy with it. Cardboard. Yes! As much as I always say I'm going to wear these, like to the gym and stuff, I hardly ever do. This one I might have to change my mind. Sweet Legend of Zelda wristband. Nope, that way. Yeah! Look at that. That is some fine stitching on that. Some quality stuff right there. I like it like it a lot. This month's pin is Batman. Oh, this is, uh, oh, it is something. I thought it was just cardboard spacing, but fortunately I looked inside because we're going to get stuff. Oh, <laughs> that is an amazing Wonder Woman poster. <laughs> so good. That is great. Oh man, I really need to get frames and stuff and ways to flatten out all these sweet posters I get. Oh man. Oh, sweet! A hardcover book called The League of Regrettable Superheroes. How can this not be amazing? Okay, I'm gonna read the back. Look up in the sky. It's a bee. It's a witch. It's a giant eyeball. You know about Batman, Superman, and Spider-Man, but have you heard of Doll Man, Dr. Hormone, or Spider Queen? In the League of Regrettable Superheroes, you'll meet 50 of the strangest superheroes ever to see print, complete with black backstories, not black stories, um, vintage art, and colorful commentary. So prepare yourself for such not-ready-for-prime-time heroes as Bee-Man, Batman, but with bees. The Eye, a giant floating eyeball. Just accept it. And many other oddballs and oddities. Drawing on the entire history of the medium, the League of Regrettable Superheroes will appeal to, appeal to die-hard comic fans, casual comic readers, and anyone who enjoys peering into the stranger corners of pop culture. Alright, that should be a good read. Not that I don't have enough stuff to read right now. 
Brawlhalla. Uh, a game, I assume, where I can unlock White Fang Nash, which I'm assuming is this fella right here. Uh, free to play. Free to play platform brawler. There we go. Cool. Alright. And then this month's magazine. So, not a lot of stuff in this month's crate, but I would definitely say it's quality stuff. Like, a hardcover book, wristband, sweet figure. Yeah, I am, I am definitely satisfied with that. And here's the box, right side up. It's just full building. Yeah. This will be a good prop for the shelf, where I've got all my figures and stuff. A new place for uh, this Batman to uh, take his Captain Morgan pose. It'll be good. I like it. I like it a lot. I keep accumulating air fresheners. I don't know what to do with those. I don't have a car anymore. Maybe I should leave them in the car to go as I drive as treasures for other people to enjoy as well. That'd be sweet. Alright. Cool. Alright. That's this month's crate. I'm excited for next month. I can't remember if the theme has already been announced, but I'll have to check that out. Um, let me know who your favorite superhero is. I know for me, my favorite growing up was uh, a lesser-known Marvel hero known known as Darkhawk, and I collected that series for as long as I possibly could, and uh, tried to finish the collection as I got older and started trying to get back into comic books, but trying to find the issues is next to impossible because it wasn't a very popular comic book so let me know what you read who your favorite hero was growing up and maybe who your favorite hero that might be coming up with the new movies is going to be there's tons of stuff over the next few years so what are you most excited to see uh check out loot crate below uh like subscribe non-playable canadians lots of gaming videos check us out on twitch we're getting more active on there as well uh slash non-playable canadians uh and yeah more every month for Loot Crate, more videos at least once a week on YouTube, and we'll see you next time. Bye!